Well, I have good news from uh, Farida Nakazwe's camp. Yes, you know, there is a way Ugandans love this woman so big time. Uh, you know, when they hear that uh, there is some news trending online and, uh, you know, this is about Farida Nakazwe, Ugandans are very, very attentive when it comes to that. And guess what? I have a big story from uh, Farida Nakazwe's camp. And maybe let me give you a hint before I get to give you the details. Uh, Farida Nakazwe has finally completed the house that uh, she started putting up for her mother. Uh, that is in a Sembaule district. That is the story that I'm bringing to you right now. And I have the pictures of the beautiful house. Ah, ah, ah. Yes, yeah, so how are you doing? Subscribe to the Buzz G just in case you haven't. And also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Now, uh, just like I said, I want to first of all congratulate Farida Nakazwe for completing her mother's house in Chibengo. Uh, for those of you who do not know where Chibengo is found, it is actually in uh, Sembabule district. I think Sembabule is still right here in uh, the central. Yes, yeah, so that is where Farida Nakazwe has put up a very beautiful house for her mother. And actually, uh, some of you have been questioning that, um, you know, Farida never talks about her parents. Are they alive or they died long time? What's up? She never talks about such. Uh, but uh, let me tell you about that a little bit. Actually, uh, Farida Nakazwe has one parent and uh, that is the mother. Yes, the father died some time back. Uh, she was still in senior four. That is when the father died. And uh, right now, Farida Nakazwe is uh, 37 years. So you really see that uh, uh, it's been a long time since the father passed on. Yes. Actually, the father was buried in a Sembabule district. Yes. So uh, the mother was staying in Masaka. But uh, recently, she decided to relocate to, you know, Sembabule, where the husband was buried. And according to Farida Nakazwe, uh, the mother sat her down and she talked to her about the plans to relocate to Sembabule. And of course, as a daughter, Farida was so much concerned. She was like, Mommy, why do you want to relocate to Sembabule? Why don't you stay right here in Masaka? Because, I mean, you're a little bit close to me. Uh, right here, I can come check on you anytime. Why do you want to go? to the other side of Sembable. But, uh, you know, the mother convinced her and, uh, you know, Farida was convinced. And guess what? Farida decided to put up a nice, simple looking modern home, just like you can see right there in the pictures. Yes, that is a new home, my friend. Yes, so Farida decided to put up that simple home. It's not simple as the word sounds because you, you may hear me saying simple and you think that maybe that is very little money. My friend, that is a very simple, nice looking modern home. Home, as you can see right there. Very nice looking. Yes, so I should say Farida Nakazwe is very happy. Yes, uh, because what she started has finally been accomplished. And uh, for us right here on the Buzz UG, uh, we would like to say congratulations upon accomplishing, you know, that amazing uh, building right there. Yes, so that is uh, the latest from uh, Farida Nakazwe's camp. And uh, subscribe to the Buzz UG in case you haven't. And uh, also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Thank you.